What are you doing here? Morning everyone, it's Rob back again with another video. How are ya? As you can see, I'm still in bed. I really need to get a job. So what can we do? I'm a bit more awake now. By the way, did I say, how are ya? Yeah, I think I did. I keep forgetting that on some videos. It's kind of my catchphrase. Right, let's get dressed. That's better. Right, let's start the day. I have to supervise sometimes because the little one bullies the big one. So when they're eating, if he's finished before he's finished, he just helps himself to his bowl. So as you can see from the title of the video, I am comparing what it was like on my Harley before I put the ape hangers on. I've got 14 inch ape hangers and I actually like them. I actually love them. Um, and I'll go through that in a bit. I need to get the bike out. It's amazing weather again. This weather isn't gonna stay with us for a little while. Oh, by the way, I have a big thing coming up for my Harley. Leave in the comments what you think it will be. It could be to do with improving the performance, things like that, you know. Also improving comfort for my pillion, my wife. So that's a bit obvious, that one. Put in comments what you think it is. I'm gonna go into the garage and get my bike out for you. I wanna show you what it looks like with me sat on the bike and we'll go from there. son's scooter over there. Anyway, let's get this beast out. I hear you breathe, but I can't see if you're right here next to me. Something's wrong, wasn't it fun? So I'll try and record a few bits for you. Um, I don't know how it's gonna sound because the camera's quite far away, but basically these are the bars. They're 14 inch and they are official Harley Davidson bars. And at the moment, how I've set them up, they are kind of not really far outstretched, but they're kind of just comfortable. They can afford, and I might even push them back a little bit, um, back that way. So at the moment, they're set in line with the forks, and I might put them just back a bit further, like away from me, just to stretch me out just a little bit. But it's a nice, comfortable position. Um, it's not hard on the shoulders or the hands or anything. So if you imagine driving in your car, your arms are quite neutral, you know. And this isn't much different really, so I'm not interested in them massive eight hangers up here, which is a bit pointless. Um, these are, like I said, 14 inch. They're not really massively tall. Um, I'm five foot seven. There's no one listening. So I can say I'm five foot seven. My wife might disagree with that, but she's not listening, so whatever. Five foot seven, yeah, I am. All right, five foot seven, okay. Five foot seven, um, so I'm quite sure, but these are still fine for me. Um, and like I said, they can go back a little bit further, which I might do anyway. And especially when Emma's riding pillion, um, she wants to squash up to me, and then I'm kind of like this, a bit squashed up. It'd be better for me if the bars were just back, just a fraction. So yeah, basically, you know, these are the, the ape hangers, as opposed to the Hollywood bars, which this bike comes standard. Now with the Hollywood bars, they're quite wide and low. So if you imagine on a motorway, I just put this camera down. So, so with the Hollywood bars, you're kind of quite wide, you're sat like that, and it's quite wide. So you've got this kind of big open area that especially when you're blasting down uh, a motorway you're taking quite a bit of a brunt of the wind 
Um, with the holly, with the uh, ape hangers, the ape hangers. Um, these are chiseled bars, they're called. So they're quite straight. They got the the sharp bends. You can get, you know, loads of different models, loads of different makes. Um, and there's a long story to getting the wires put through these bars. But anyway, um, yeah. So you're kind of fists up in the air. The area is a bit less for going through uh, the wind and cutting through. So for me, it does feel a bit easier going through the the wind on a motorway than the Hollywood bars. So it is actually more efficient. The wind's just picking up and it's a little bit cooler today. Um, but while the sun's out, I thought I'd make this video. So Hollywood bars are low and wide. These bars are quite high and narrow, but they're not overly high. So like I said, I'm five foot seven and these are 14 inch bars. I've got forward controls on here with the footboards which I love and like I said my legs aren't very long and I test rode a few with the pegs with the foot pegs um, I test rode a fat bob with the foot pegs and it did feel like it was a bit of a stretch for me and even though my feet were on the pegs it felt like they could kind of fall fall off if, if you like whereas with the footboards I can move my feet round I can I can sort of put my legs right out forward and and hang my sort of my toes out to the side and it feels much more comfortable so that is the ape hangers versus the hollywood bars on my soft tail slim and if you've got any questions or queries comments leave them below that is it from me see you on the next video